Oh, whoa. There we go. Mm. Okay, hi friends and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. I'm gonna try and get through this without sweating. I just turned the loud AC off, but I think we can do it because we have a little short one today. This is just a quick order from Fashion Nova and you'll be proud of me. There is no black items in here. I'm finally, you know, getting some color in my wardrobe. So I'll just start with what's on top and what's most fun for the pervs, a bra and underwear set. This, um, they had a few different colors and I almost got like this seafoam green, but I'm happy I went with this dusty rose because it's just really pretty. Um, what attracted me to this was this bralette. It has like, um, thicker sleeves or I guess just a sleeve in general. I thought this was really cute. So like a thick strap, with a little cap sleeve, I just thought that's a cute look in a bralette, um, so I wanted to try it out. I got this in a 2X. It um, has a little hook and eye thing in the back, and this one I trust pretty well. I had this on for a while, and I was not experiencing any slippage or anything, so you got that little enclosure in the back. But then it does branch out, get a little thicker with the lace, so I like a kind of thicker, you know, kind of strap and just all around thickness going on just to hold me in. I always say I got like big back boobies like I got a solid C cup back there so I like to be a little held in back there you don't want like a strap going in and completely disappearing into your fat so I like some coverage back there um, this has a very very deep cut which I really like but this isn't super supportive so I was kind of just like hanging there I would like if like you kind of pick it up like if there was an adjustable strap which there isn't and I don't know how you would do that just to pick them up a little. Could you imagine having like really perky boobs in a thing like this? That will look so awesome. But I'm pretty happy with where this sat on me. It's gonna be mainly for like comfy wear and if you have a boyfriend, girlfriend, whoever, you can wear it for them too. But there is no underwire in here so I wasn't getting, you know, A plus boobs. I was at like a B plus, which I'm still pretty happy with. But there is a little cup, lightly lined, um, lightly padded, you're not gonna get like nipples everywhere. Um, but I just thought this was really cute. I, I love like having, it looks like a top. I just really like that. So if my boobs were just like a little higher, you know, you know, gravity, I think it would be the perfect little bralette, but they were like just there. So but yeah, they were literally just there. Um, but I really like the color on this. And then it came with matching underwear. These were really cute, really stretchy. I got this whole shebang in a 2X. Um, I probably could have sized down to a 1X in the underwear just because they're really stretchy and I did find a little bit of excess fabric like the fun frilly stuff around the butt. That was just like a little loose. I don't have a butt. Um, it's just back of the leg to the back so there's no butt there. But um, how many times can I say butt? I did find there was a little excess fabric but I think the scalloped little lace detail is really cute on the butt. Cuts you really well, like like I said, I don't have a butt, but it kind of gave the illusion of one. So I really like how this was cut. Um, a lot more coverage than I was expecting, so I like that. I do prefer some coverage down there, so I like this. Really cute. And again, in that dusty pink, this can kind of substitute as a nude. Not really, but kind of. Disclaimer, I had to shut off my camera for a second and then when I turned it on, I'd also turned the AC back on, so there is going to be a hum throughout the rest of this video, and I'm really sorry. Ugh, I'm so bad at this. Okay, the next item is one of my favorites. I am just in need of basic, regular work shirts. Like, you know when you wake up and you have 10 minutes to get out of the house, you throw on some pants, and you're just like, I need like a nice-ish shirt. Here we go. And I just think this is really cute. So it is, again, that dusty baby pink, a pleated shirt with a little, um, I guess, lettuce cut neckline up here, like a little mock neck, nothing crazy. And then the whole shirt is pleated, big billowy arms that come in at the cuff. I just think this is really cute. I got this one in a 2X. You can size down. My regular size is a 1X. Um, just so order your regular size just because the length on this was so long. So this was like tunic length on me and it just looked a little frumpy as a big shirt. So I grabbed one of my skirts and tucked it in and it looked so much better tucked into a skirt. The one I tucked it into is another Fashion Nova skirt, but like that or a black skirt, a pencil skirt, skater skirt, it's gonna look so good tucked in because I think it just looks better like having this and the neckline on display than like 
just miles and miles of pleating down your body. Um, so I like the pleating, but too much of it all over your body, I don't think is the best thing. So I think the best way to wear this is tucked into a skirt. It looks really cute, really classy. Again, great for work. Um, lots of coverage, very modest. A little see-through, it's chiffon, so pop on a cami on underneath, you're fine. But I just think it was really cute. If you want to wear it as a tunic, be my guest, but I think it looks really, really pretty tucked into a skirt. And again, get your regular size. There's tons of room in there, you'll be fine. So these were the thing that made me do an order in the first place. They're these, again, dusty pink. I know I said I didn't get black, but now everything's just dusty pink. And this one's more of a darker pink, so like a mauve. So these paper bag shorts, I think these are really cute, really stretchy. The material all over is stretchy. Um, I thought they'd be a little more structured and I'm happy they're not because it's just more breathable and comfortable with the stretch all over. So paper bag shorts, which means it just kind of looks, again, that kind of like lettuce cut overflow up here. So that's the paper bag style. It has a belt. I kind of left it as it came. It was through the belt and then tied through. Um, basically it's just for decoration because I feel like the elasticity in the um, waist holds you in just fine. So the belt's for decoration, but it is adjustable if you need to like bring yourself in a little bit more. So these I also got in a 2X, but again, they are very stretchy. I could have gotten a 1X and been fine, but I'm happy with how the 2X fit. They do have pockets and they're pretty deep, so I like that. And um, I just really like the color. I thought this was really cute. Something different, and now I can wear these with all my bodysuits and it'll look really cute. And again, throw on like a denim jacket for like a cold summer night really really cute something different on the bottom because I feel like I'm mainly like leggings or whatever on the bottom so to have a cute pink short I was gonna say really cute but it's gonna look really cute um not the biggest fan of how my crotch looks in these but I feel like I bring that up in every video where I wear a short or a romper and overall so maybe just maybe not everyone's looking at my crotch the way I think they are it's not uncomfortable but I see the smile crotch but I just gotta get over that. No one's looking at my crotch, even though I just pointed it out a thousand times. So in the model picture on the website with those shorts, the model was wearing a pink jacket to go with it, and I thought it was this one. It was not, because the pinks are a little different, but I really like this one. So it's like a little cutaway light blazer. Um, it's not like a full outerwear jacket. It's more so like a shirt. Um, but it's marketed as a little blazer. So it does come in, oh, let me button it, hold on. Comes in with a single button under the boobs and then cascades into like a nice little light peplum waterfall, um, high-low around your back. Really, really cute, really flattering. If you're someone like me who carries a lot of their weight in the lower stomach, it's gonna cascade over that really nicely. So I was really impressed with this. Like, again, I got it to just be like a compliment to these. And then I was like, I could wear this on its own. I kind of like it better buttoned, but you can, again, wear it unbuttoned as a little blazer. But it just falls off the body really nicely. I also really like how the arms fit me. I think it was a perfect length. There was no bagginess. So I like the sleek look of that. I want to say, what's the opposite of being a slob? I don't know, but this is the opposite of slob. I felt really, really good in this one. And this one I did get in a 1X, and I'm happy I did. For a second there, I was like, oh, I don't know, I should have sized up. But I really like how this, like, fit me and then went out at certain spots so I'm happy I went with my true size. Alright, this one's just a little fun and I, I wish I had gotten it like a month earlier. I could have worn it to Pride. So it's just a little um, tool shrug but it's in like the perfect gradient of rainbow. This is like perfect for Taylor Swift's new album era and she's all just like rainbowy and like fluttery and stuff. Um, if only I was a fan. But if you are, you know, you can totally wear this to her new tour, but just like really cute, light and airy. Could you buy your own tool and make this from the fabric store? Probably, but it was really expensive. So I was like, this is just a cute little thing to have. Again, I'll keep it around for next year's Pride. Great vacation wear. I popped it on over just like a black cami and um, leggings just to see what, how it would look. But this would look good over like jeans, white top, this, really cute. Just like really jazzes up an outfit. And it's nice and billowy. I believe this isn't a 1X, yeah. 1X, you'll be fine. Honestly, it's like a big piece of fabric, so don't worry about the fit, you'll get in there. But I just think the gradient on this is so pretty. 
finally, I got a red dress. Um, Jonas Brothers girls will get this, but they're going back on tour and I want to wear a red dress to the tour. High heels, red dress, you know. Okay, so I saw this and I thought it was really cute. It has sleeves because I'm just so tired of cutouts and not being able to wear a bra with things. So it has sleeves. It does have this um, rubber lining along this because I think it's like you can wear it as an off the shoulder kind of bardeau thing and the rubber lining helps it stay where it's supposed to be on your skin. But I popped it on over my shoulders. It looked fine. It felt fine. So that's how I'm going to wear it. But it does have the capability of being like off the shoulder bardeau kind of top and the rubber will help it stay. I like it regular. So it also has um, like a half sleeve that you could bunch up and leave it here or you can wear it like halfway down your arm. So I don't know the style I like in the try on. I couldn't get the one to stay. So like one's up here, one's down there. Let me know which um, length you like better. But really easy, basic red dress. It comes with a belt and it has those D-rings that I was like, how are we gonna focus? How do people tie these? And somehow on my first attempt, I did it. I don't know if I'm ever gonna be able to do that again, but I got the D-ring to go in, made it a functioning belt. So it does have a belt to cinch you in at the waist. I think it looks really, really cute like that. Um, I was wearing black underwear and I had to look for the underwear, but I did see them. So um, I would just go nude underwear, but I think you'll be fine, like you don't need a slip, but just go nude and not like big black underwear as I always wear. Um, go nude and you'll be fine because this is pretty thick, but I was looking. So I think it's just a me thing. Like I always look for underwear. I always look for the smile crotch. I, it's just a weird Shannon thing. But um, you know, just air on the side of nude underwear. But I just thought this was really, really cute. Okay, so that was it. Just a quick little, I think that was like five items, Fashion Nova haul. Branching out and wearing colors. Are you proud of me? Um, everything will be linked down below. All my sizes will be linked down below. I also have a Fashion Nova discount code. Use that. Happy shopping. If you're new here, I do plus size fashion videos every Wednesday and I'm gonna start doing vlogs again because I just auditioned for The Bachelor and I vlogged it. So I feel like that's a fun little vlog. Maybe that'll come out this weekend, we'll see. But please subscribe if you haven't already. Kinda mad that I did my hair and put my makeup on because I'm going to spin class in an hour so I feel like it's just like a waste. But I'll, I'll cherish it for the next hour. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.